And uh, you're going to witness something now which you, you won't see very often, I promise you. Is some front loading skills. And uh, don't look at my facial expressions because you're probably going to see some weird and wonderful stuff. <laughs> some, you know, tongues, tongues out, hanging out of my mouth while I'm trying to concentrate on putting these on. But um, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Yeah, so as I was explaining, the the auto leveling system. So basically, as, when you put a pallet down, as you pick it up, it's everything stays the same. So it's moving. I was going to point. <laughs> I was going to point on the monitor. Hang on, it's, it, oh, you can't see. But it's it basically both both cylinders that have to move at the same time to keep the pallet level. If that makes sense. Um, so that's what the auto leveling system does on a on a front loader. Uh, Trying to get as close as I want to put a couple of these on. Yeah. Um, big man two four zero zero. Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're well. Rain bells are more of a challenge. Rolling all over the place. Yeah, they are. Yeah, I didn't think of that, uh, uh, Jax. Um, yeah, I went for aesthetics. I went for looks rather than <laughs> practicality there. Um, oh. Oh. Okay. What have I done here? Oh, do. Okay, we're up. Oh, this is going to be painful to watch. Yeah, I did. I did warn you. I can't. You know, normally by now I'll be thinking to myself, right, okay, I need to uh, either uh, pause the recording and, um, yeah, and then just magically appear. You know, da-da, this, <laughs> look what I've done, five minutes or 20 minutes later. Uh, or I would uh, put a time lapse going. Um, okay, that looks okay. Let's buy another two, because that's not going to last us very long. Pallets. So we'll get some seeds, buy. And some fertilizer, bye. And uh, we might also get some lime as well. Put the lime in the coconut. <laughs> and, um, oh, wow. Uh, let's load the, these up. Hopefully, we can fit them all on our trailer. Small squares are more traditional, rain was uh, short-lived in efficiency. Oh, right. Uh, even in the UK, uh, you know, um, you do see a lot of, you see a lot of rain bales, um, but uh, I wasn't aware that they're less efficient than the, uh, the square bales. Hopefully, I can just nudge this one, put two next to each other. Oh, no, 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 no. Stay there. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I told you. Oh gosh, uh, Sokolos is the best farmer out there. No, no, big man, you're 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 wrong. You, yeah, you're wrong. Probably. The jammiest farmer out there, I'd probably say. Wow, I'm impressed they didn't go flying into the winterlands. Oh, yeah. Well, there's still time yet, though, uh, Case. Um, big squares are de uh, pack denser. Ah, okay. Oh, there you go. I'm learning all sorts today.
Look at the concentration in my face. Oh, look at that. Lovely. Front loading skills for, for days. Oh, look at that. Lovely. You watch me uh, mess it up now on the uh, on the last bail. I'm gonna get too confident, and uh, that's where things go wrong. <laughs> I get too cocky. Uh, see, I can't even get the holes now in the pallet, uh, the forks in the pallet. Cool. Let's stick this one on the end. I can't load pallets like this. Uh, I use an auto loading trailer. Big man, me too. I'm just very cautious of money, um, so I'm trying to do this on a. Trying to do this on a. On a budget. Ooh. Could probably fit another pallet on here if I'm. Oh no! Don't you dare flip trailer. Uh, no, I'm not going to risk putting another pallet on there. I think that's going to do for the time being. Let's just strap this bad boy down and call that good. There we go. Any more straps? There we go. And here. Brilliant. Okay. So let's uh, get this back down to the uh, to the farm. I don't know whether to sell that one. Are we only need one? No. We'll have two. Um, because I think we're going to end up buying the other field. Uh, field number 10, is it? Uh, and the hoses are connected for the brakes. Brilliant. And let's go. Ooh. So that was rel relatively painless, wasn't it? Hey, congrats. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it was giving me the big thumbs up now. Like I've just done something absolutely incredible. I suppose for me... Um, I have, you know, that, that it doesn't normally look that neat, or yeah. So I'm, I'm quite quite pleased. So this, you know, hang on. so in the last two days, I've landed at an airport with no papi light, papi lights, or um, or any indication at all, no lights, uh, and I landed, and I've done the best landing I could have done, and I've just done some front loading skills. So you guys are uh, just good luck. That's all I could put it down to. It certainly isn't skill. Why don't you strap the pallets to the trailer before you do that? Yeah, good thinking. <laughs> Tough. Yeah, good thinking. Uh, maybe I should have done that. Oh. Um, you've been watching uh, old. <coughs> yeah. Bains are awesome. I'm the one that sent the big box of candy to see the Spenders to trail. Oh, oh, New York, JFK. And taxi into the gate. Uh, Try landing at New York. New York. Wow, that'd be. Uh, I think uh, sort of long haul flights um, for streams and stuff. Uh, I, I, I don't know. Um, you know these nine hour, ten hour flights. I'd like to do one just just so I could do one, but um, uh, I don't know how to. You know, because <laughs> once you're up there, you're up there, aren't you? For nine hours, um, unless you know, we could play two games. You know, we get the uh, while we're on the flight. You know, we we'll hook up some uh, some football. Uh, sorry, some farming sim, and uh, play some farming sim. Maybe I don't know. Case okay, so you'll have to go back and watch that one. Yeah, I was super proud of myself. I managed to land. Okay, let's try and overtake this car. Stocko Dagoin mentioned uh, you in one of his streams a while ago, did he? <laughs> I've, uh, yeah, Dagoin's done amazing. I, I love what he does with his survival series. Uh, he puts a lot of time and effort into his uh, into his let's plays, and I'm uh, I'm a big fan. Yeah, but uh, absolutely feeling the love today. So I wonder how Ewan's getting on. Uh, I've got the inspector mod. I think it's the inspector mod or some some sort. But you can see in the top right soccer gloss. It just tells me basically what I've got. I mean, uh, pallet fork, 
Oh, and then you see, oh yeah, okay. And you see underneath there, you see seeds at 30% and fertilizer at 46. So, okay, good. So I can see how he's getting on. So it's the next turn in on the right. How do you feel about driving around in the UK? Yeah, Sir Lord Custard, I, yeah, I drive a lot in the UK. Um, my job is to drive around predominantly the UK and Europe. Um, so yeah, I'll do a do quite a few miles in the UK. I don't mind it. Uh, the traffic's getting worse. There's, there's more people on the road. Now, I sound so old, don't I? Back in my day, you know, it was easier to move around. But uh, yeah, there's a, there's a lot of people on the road. And uh, yeah, roads need to be bigger, for sure. <laughs> uh, we're going to turn right here. And that should keep us going for maybe to the next harvest, possibly. But, um, but yeah, these pallets, they, they, I think they, they, they do work out a little bit cheaper. Uh, there's also no one, uh, there's almost no one on the roads at the moment. Oh, I bet. Um, yeah, Mrs. Stocker Gloss would not allow me out that outside the house. <laughs> Um, not even to go in the car and, uh, and have a bit of a drive. Um, no. Uh, she says, all I'm allowed to do is look out the window. Uh, that's all I'm allowed to do. And it's quite quiet around our neighbourhood anyway. Um, but, uh, yeah, it is super quiet. Um, we have uh, a lot of elderly that live near us, so just making sure that they're okay as well and um, they're not wanting for anything. Um, we're just trying to do our bit to make sure... Everyone, is, everyone around us is 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 safe and and um, and has everything they need. Um, yeah, but uh, yeah, we, we stood out yesterday uh, in the UK. I don't know if you guys know, um, but um, we let me park you here. We um, we stood outside and we clapped at eight o'clock in the evening. Um, oh, to touch the hoses. There we go. Uh, for the NHS, uh, to thank the NHS staff, uh, all the people on the front line, uh, for uh, for the work that they do. And uh, so we was out there clapping, and I think we were the only people out there because, uh, like I say, a lot of elderly live near us. So it just felt a little bit weird clapping <laughs> at our doorstep. But uh, we've done it. Uh, do I have a garden? Yes, i got a garden. A uh, fairly big garden for the dogs, uh, thankfully. It keeps them sane. Uh, while we're uh, while we're stuck in, uh, okay. Let me see if I can replicate the front loading skills. Um, oh yeah! Look at that. He was born. He was born to be a front loader, wasn't he? <laughs> oh, Quillard. Hello. Is this better than seventeen? Uh, yes. Yeah, it is. Uh, I think so. Um, I think graphic-wise and and what you can do with it. Um, again, the mods make a big difference. I think. Um, I think the mods make a make a difference for sure. Um, we did that clap in for the. Uh, uh, Frontline workers, yep, custard. We've done the same, mate. Uh, yeah, I know what you mean. It's uh, super quiet living in a small village. Yeah, we're not in a village. Yeah, we're uh, just outside of Gloucester. Well, yeah, there's a, a town just outside Gloucester. Um, but I think the area that we live is predominantly for sort of the older folk. And um, yeah, it's been a little bit quiet. Uh oh. It's going too well. Uh. Yeah, I think 17 was great. Um, but again, it, I think 19 just looks... 
just looks better. Um, oh, that's my my view. I, I enjoy 17. To be fair, there is. I don't think there's a massive difference. Oh, this thing's quite heavy. I don't think there's a huge a huge difference between. Um, put some line here between 17 and 19. But um, there's still good mods out for 17 and support. Oh, uh, looks like Ewan's slipping. Oh God, what are you doing? Oh, I didn't think I was going to recover that. Okay, well, he's finished. No, he hasn't. Look at all these missed points. He's, yeah. So we're going to have to finish this. Good news is, though, I think we may be able to do it. Let's lower that. Turn that on. I think we might be able to finish this on one tank of uh, canola and fertilizer. Possibly. Would there be a 2021? Um, the bloom. Well, we, we, we were discussing this earlier, and it looks uh, well. Somebody mentioned that um, they're not bringing out a 2021 version, but um, I don't know. I think uh, uh, maybe Dagoin have posted a video about it. I'm not sure. But uh, yeah, I hope they do. Uh, I want to see what else they can do. Um, you know, see what's what's planned for uh, for FS21. The interesting times. Ah, uh, okay, I understand. So FS21 isn't this year, uh, but it is next year when the new um, consoles come in. Understood. Okay. So they're waiting for the consoles to catch up, really. Yeah. Yeah. Case. Yeah. Good point. That's probably the biggest change is that um, you can actually build the farm uh, how you want to build it. Um, you know, you, you can um, you can uh, choose. Where to place things, and and you can you know adjust the terrain. You can uh, you can literally sort of shape it and and and, and map it how you uh, how you want, which is uh, which is fantastic. Okay, what's that done? Let's get this one done. Let's turn on those beacons. Uh, have you seen anything about the farm sim network? A huge community uh, of farmers online working together. Uh, Custard, I haven't. Um, but that sounds amazing. And um, yeah, if you have some more information about that, uh, please post it on Twitter, uh, and I'll uh, I'll look into it. Uh, I'd like to be a part of that. That sounds that sounds great. Hey, bro, uh, it's still here. Come to hunt me down and beat me to a pulp. <laughs> So Ewan uh, has been doing some seeding for us, but it looks like he hasn't, uh, well, he's missed some bits. So we're just tidying this field up. Shouldn't take too long. I think we may need to uh, to fill up. I don't think we're going to be lucky enough to have all this in one uh, in one tank. We might be okay. We don't. But uh, oh man, you guys are amazing! Thank you so much for for all the uh, oh and Rumsey, you know, you legend. Thank you so much. Really, really appreciate you guys taking your time out of your day to uh, to sit down and watch silly of me try and play farming games.
don't know why he's missed all these. It's strange. Bit of in the cab view. We haven't done that today. Oh, it's a bit stuttery. FSN is cool looking, uh, but for what I've seen uh, from Squad and some others, it takes time to, 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 uh, to be on almost every day. FSN. What's what's uh, sorry? What's FSN? Uh, case. FSN is cool looking. We haven't done much cab view. I don't think this stream at all. Um, it looks amazing, doesn't it? This this map just looks just incredible. Are there any mods in your uh, in your chat farm sim network? What I was talking about. Um, is there any mods? Uh, oh yes, uh, well I was going to show the mods when I, uh, so we do that at the end of the stream, uh, probably stream till about half three UK time. Um, so, probably another 30, 35 minutes ish, and then uh, I'll show you the, uh, I'll show you my mod list, well all the mods I got installed. Farm Sim Network, sorry FSN, right. I don't know anything about it, uh, Case. Um, I'll have to look into that. Um, let me just check that. Put it on my notepad. Cool. Uh, MAFE W64. Yes, it is. It's actually based um, very close to where I live. Uh, so I live in a uh, place called Gloucester in the UK. And uh, this is um, just uh, literally just at the road from me. Um, so I'm. I'm so it's very, uh, very nostalgic, and <laughs> it's awesome to to see some of the uh, some of the roads and signs that I see pretty much every day. Uh, sorry, mate. I'm used to streaming that has mods to moderate the game and take uh, take notes for the stream. Oh, take notes for the stream. <laughs> um, I, I think I've made people mods before. I, I, uh, to be honest, uh, we've got you know, like, like I was saying about this, um, you know, this amazing uh, you know the amazing people in 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 in, in the simming you know community. Um, it's very rare do you need to moderate the chat. You know, everyone gets on. Everyone's happy. Everyone's good, you know happy to be here. Uh, if you're not, then you probably just leave, I guess. Um, so, yeah. So, it's, yeah. Well, there you go. Uh, Bruiser, I think Brew. Yeah, yeah Bruiser mod, and uh, um, obviously Nightbot there. You know, he, watch out for him. He, he's a bit. Uh, yeah, he's <laughs> he's a bit a uh, bit, bit mean sometimes, but um, yeah. And I think the FSN has like three or six months waiting period to get whitelisted in the FSN program. All right, case. I'll have to look into it. I don't know anything about it, buddy. Um, I will. Uh, I will look into that for sure. Thanks for uh, letting me know. I'm thinking we might be able to do this on just one tank of uh, seeds and fertilizer. Now, if you remember, uh, the seeder, uh, the the, you need to keep everything obviously um, uh, repaired. Because as as the seeder gets damaged, it uses more fertilizer, more canola, and more seed. Um, so it's always it's always a you know my top tip is definitely to keep to keep this thing uh, repaired fully. You can feel the whole cab just tilt as you go around that corner on a on a bank. Oh, I love it! I love it. Hey, Stocko, you're well, and thank you, oh, Ramsey, for the sub. Awesome. Yes, hidden under and hider and hidder hidden. And hitter, thank you so much. Yes, I hope you're well. Uh, I'm used to nut slammer, which can be very brutal. <laughs> okay, um, harassment for me than anything. Case, yeah, 
you uh, you give Brew a little bit of uh, harassment every now and then. I think he likes it though. I think he likes it, Case. Okay. Hey, Stocko. Uh, when I ran course play. Uh, I would program the work error, uh, just have it plot the course every time I went to use it. Um, so change kit didn't require complete reprogramming. Uh, so have it plot the course every time I went to use it. Uh, so changing kit didn't require. Hmm. Okay. Not quite sure what that means, Big Trucker. <laughs> the changing, uh, the changing kit. Um. Oh, that's that's not done. Look at that just see. Oh, I think there's a bit up here to do. We've got six percent. We've got thirty-one seeds left. Oh, this thing is quite uh, quite accurate with how much seed it's holding. <laughs> thirty-one seeds. <laughs> We've got that little bit there, and that's it. This this field is is done and seeded. Cool. Well, good job. Let's check this out now. So it's ploughed. Um, this one's being fertilised. This should be showing fertilising. Uh, let's go. Okay, so no weeds. They're both fertilised. This needs to be fertilised again. Um, although it, it looks darker, doesn't it? That looks darker than that. So it looks like this is showing like a second fertiliser, but we haven't fertilised this twice. So I am going to fertilise this again. Uh, needs ploughing. Nope, they're both ploughed. And this one needs some lime now, so we need to saute that. Cool. Thinking, do we buy that field down here at number 10? Um, how much money we got? We got just under 800,000. I think we'll wait for the first harvest and then we'll, uh, then we'll think about it. Don't like driving on freshly. Cool. Uh, record uh, the field area, save, and then when you go to work, load the field, uh, tell the size, and activate. Okay, okay, okay. I, I I understand what you mean. Yeah. So basically, I'm just recording it, and then you know, pressing go straight away. I should come out of it, go back in, and just check the sizes again. Uh, tell the size and then activate. Understood. Okay, well, we'll fill this bad boy up. And. I might be able to fill it up from here. And if I do this. Nope. Do that. There we go. Cool. I don't know whether I'm going to fit through there. No, I'm not even going to risk it. <laughs> oh. There we go. Uh, we fill up the canola. So this is now ready for next time. Um. Just going to stick a stick it in here. So we disconnect the wires, uh, or the or the hoses, I should say. Turn it. I'm gonna turn it off. All right. 
There we go. Cool. Right, so both fields are done. We need to sort out some liming. So we're going to buy ourselves a a Lyman, um, go to a fertilizer. Uh, and we're going to choose one for lime. This one will be for lime and fertilizer. It's quite cheap, 31,000. Looks uh, pretty big as well, it holds a lot. Um, got this tracked one here for 51. <laughs> um, that's just for fertilizer only. Um, well, maybe we should get one that just goes on the end of our sort of 50, 24 meters. That's pretty pretty good. It doesn't hold a lot, but we don't really need it to hold too much. Um, 24 meters, 24 meters. Uh, yeah, that one looks pretty good. Well, it says 15 meters there and 24 there. I don't know. Normally go with one of these breeder ones, but uh, let me go for this one. I think we always go for this one. <laughs> it's got a twelve meter. Yeah, that'll be that'll be fine. Wow. Okay. Uh, lots of uh, lots of chat. I'm um, here building a new reactor on a server. Okay. Um, oh. Yeah. Uh, the more uh, more record promoter than when you go to work it set implement and let it calculate the route okay okay understood um, remember the nuclear beacon um, and the one episode nether house the they yeah, the nuclear beacon I think didn't Dur blow it up at the end um, he has a nuclear reac reactor inside of a, a lighthouse in minecraft um, yeah it got evaporated <laughs> yeah it did it got evaporated um, is it falling in the intended direction? Did it? I can't even remember. Gosh, it was so long ago. That was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. Okay, so I think we're going to go for the breedle here. Um, it holds it holds more. It's only thirty nine thousand. Um, so it's a spreader system. Yeah, I guess let's go for the bigger one. Um, I'm going to go narrow tires. Uh, so. Oh, we can have an extension. Yeah, 48,000. All in. Happy days. Let's go. Cool. So, we're going to drive up to the uh, to the dealer again and pick up our uh, our lime trolley. I think on the way, there's a lime station that you can actually buy some lime from. So, we'll have a look at that and pick that up as well. Uh, the light has a special uh, blocks to protect the base. Okay. <laughs> uh, Dura got involved in that. I didn't. Um, anything that anything that was good in our Minecraft series was because of Dura. Not, <laughs> nothing to do with me. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, you know, I tried building a house and then ended up burning it down, but um, that was probably my biggest contribution to the uh, <laughs> to Minecraft. Um, ignited his house on fire. Exactly, case. Yeah, my point exactly. Yeah. In the Twilight Forest. Oh. Oh, good times, weren't they? Good times. If you don't know what we're talking about, then uh, if you look on my YouTube channel, um, there's a Minecraft series I've done with Dur, uh, Dur Tebbers, and um, yeah, go go check it out. It was a lot of fun. So yeah, there's a farm on the right hand side, I think, coming up. That you can actually buy the the lime from. Oh, 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 oh gosh. <laughs> Whoops. Just wiped out a bus stop. Um or was it uh at the biogas? Oh gosh. No, lime stations at the Oak Glen farm. So yeah, we'll pick up the trailer and then we'll head up to Oak Glen Farm and uh, go see what they're having. Go get some lime. 
Uh, I have to go and won't be a pain for Case and Brew for the rest of the day. Bloom, thank you so much uh, for, for stopping along. Uh, you can catch the rest. There's only 20 minutes left. Yeah, 20 minutes and I'll be uh, I'll be stopping the stream. But um, yeah, and then uh, you can check out the rest on uh, on the YouTubes. Oh, you're bigger than me. Let me move over. Yeah, so in there, Oak Glen Farm, I think there's a lime station so you can fill up our trailer, uh, our lime trailer from there. And then we've got the bags at the farm then just to keep us topped up for a little while. <coughs> but yeah, well, thank you, uh, yeah, thanks everybody for uh, for joining us today. Uh, we'll, we, yeah, we'll, we'll be back tomorrow as well. Um, and grow the farm. Yeah, you know, because yeah, you know, this this time next year we'll be millionaires. <laughs> oh, gotta laugh or you cry. Money in this game just doesn't last for me. <laughs> oh, sorry, car. Okay, we're at the uh, New Holland dealer. Uh, there's our breedle. We do need to uh, to clean our vehicles as well because they're filthy yep all connected lovely so we've still got to buy a combine harvester yet um, need to figure out which one we're going to buy it needs to fit through that gap um, so it can't be so I think the gap is around about you know the, the you know the uh, the cedar that we've got you know so we want the header to, to either fit through that gap or to be a foldable header um, that's the uh, that's the plan um, big trucker normally I'll be sleeping at this time in Stocko if it wasn't for this panic closing <laughs> uh, closing my customers yeah, yeah oh gosh where am I going um, I hear. Uh, maybe tomorrow. What I'm going to do is I might. Um, I might be a little bit later. Uh, say we kick off at sort of half one, two o'clock in the UK, and then maybe stream till uh, five, six o'clock. Um, we'll uh, we'll probably start a little bit later tomorrow. I don't know. Or we may start at the same time and just go on a little bit later for uh, all our friends across the pond and uh, throughout the world who uh, wants to catch the stream. Because I, I, yeah, six forty-five is a little bit early. <laughs> I, I imagine. Now, is it this one? Let me just double check. It is indeed. There is a lime station in Oak Glen. Oak Glen Farm. So let's find this uh, lime station. Let's remove the cover. And I don't know where it is. <laughs> So I'm just looking for it. It says R to to refill. Uh, does anybody know what it looks like? Oh, that could be it there. That looks okay. And that's the one. R, brilliant. Yeah, we want lime. Fill that bad boy up. Uh, you could just leave the combine for now. Yeah, Case, you're right. Um, but, uh, yeah, we could sort that out tomorrow, couldn't we? Uh, what we do um, is we're lining that field. and that, Well, no, we probably won't. Uh, we might line that field. And that would probably be it for today. Uh, if that's your lime container, how big are your gin and tonics? Wow, well, Mafia, I tell you. Yeah. I am a big fan of gin and tonic at the moment. Oh, uh, yeah. Me, I'm a, I'm a cider. Cider lager. You know, pints. That, uh, that, that's my that's my fill. Um, but recently, I say recently, you know, I haven't been out for a few weeks now, but um, certainly during the Cheltenham races, I went to Cheltenham 
and um, I found myself having a couple of lagers and then getting straight onto the gin and tonics and oh I loved it <laughs> it's just uh, as my dad says you know just seeing me with a gin and tonic glass it just uh, doesn't look right but uh, uh, Soko I have to go uh, have a great stream uh, everyone hey Rumsey thank you Rumsey thank you so much mate really 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 appreciate it really appreciate your time and, and, and all the subs that you've given today uh, you sir are a legend and um, I hope to speak to you very 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 soon thank you very much Rumsey have a good day take care um, yeah so uh, so yeah uh, the gin um, you know all sorts of weird and wonderful gins uh, the flavor of gins the pink gins and all sorts I, I, I love it all yeah I suppose we could always do some missions, couldn't we, if we get a little bit short of money. But I'm trying not to spend anything. I just want to keep us keep us lean and mean, you know, in the farm at the moment. Until we've got everything. And then we can... Uh, and then we can... Um, yeah, start increasing, getting things bigger. Bigger and better. Uh, have you tried your cider with the hops in it? Uh, big trucker. Uh, I've tried hoppy lager. Uh... There's a lager in there uh, called, is it 88 or something? Or, or I can't remember what the lager's called, but that's quite a hoppy lager. We've also got a, um, a brewery called Gloucester Brewery. Um, and um, we've we done a, um, a tour, a brewery tour, um, where we got to taste the hops before and after it gets fermented and, and kind of made our own beer as such. And that was a good crack. That was a good laugh. Um, so... Uh, but not hoppy cider. I no, I've never tried cider with hops in it. Ooh, come on, you can do it. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, we're struggling a bit here. You could do it. Right, so funny enough, the uh, what field is that? Field number nine doesn't require liming, but uh, field number eight does. Oh god, I knew I took that too quick. I knew I took that corner too quick. There's a bit of weight in this uh, in this Lyman trailer, for sure. Apple cider brewed with hops. I've never tried it, big trucker. I may have tried it without knowing that I've tried it, but um, it doesn't ring a bell. I just want to double check as well. I've got the right field. Yeah, it is field eight that needs liming. That's, uh, that's so weird. And this looks like it's already fertilized twice, but uh, I'm still going to go over it with a fertilizer. Uh, we, we do that tomorrow. But our last thing today is we're going to lime that field. Shouldn't take us too long with this, uh, with this big old thing. Let's go. Guess who's back? Yes, Tommy. <laughs> back again. I'm back. Uh, during the, uh, as I've been explaining, you know, sort of during this, uh, these crazy times, these uh, unprecedented times. Um, I want to be here. So playing this game for you guys and, and for me you know I think I, I might have been playing this anyway um, so it's nice to to stream it for you peeps uh, 
Hey, big trucker, I hear you, mate. Um, you know, my works, we're, we're in the same boat at the moment. Um, hey, new follower, Maff, uh, MaffW64, thank you. Thank you so much for your follow, much appreciated. Um, so, guys, uh, you know, please follow or, or, or go onto Twitter to uh, just to just to check out uh, when I'm uh, going to be streaming, if you, you know, if you want to, of course. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, tomorrow is probably going to be a little bit later. I'd like to say about one half one UK time, um, just to give our uh, friends across the pond a chance to wake up and, and, and join us as well. <clears throat> Probably this lime gets your tractor covered, doesn't it? Gets everywhere. Look at it. It is uh, quite therapeutic as well. <laughs> Just dust in the big field full of white stuff. It's like snow. That had to be that one little bit that I missed. There we go. Hey, Gav. How you doing? Welcome. Hope you're well. <clears throat> yeah, I hope you're all uh, safe and well. Family. During these, uh, during these crazy times. We should have enough in our tank uh, to finish this field. Uh, yep, we're, we're okay, uh, Gav. Thank you. Yep. The dogs, to be fair, because we're not walking the dogs at the moment, um, they're doing all right. Yeah, obviously they don't understand what's going on at the moment, um, but they're, uh, yeah, they're, 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 they're coping. They're coping. So, as long as they're coping... Oh, I'm not supposed to turn that off. As long as they're coping, that's all that matters. I do love this map. Just... Just looks amazing. Has um, Oxygen David... I, I, I've been out the loop a little bit. Uh, has he created any more any more maps around this area you know of? Um, if so, let me know. Yeah, Sandy Bay should be soon. Oh, that's right, Sandy Bay. I remember that one. Just missed it. <laughs> you have to go back for that one. There we go. Well, that's that is definitely a limed field. And uh, done and dusted. Okay, according to my uh, my PDA, I guess you call it a PDA. Uh, this doesn't need liming at all. So, good job. Uh, there's no weeds. Uh, all we got to do is fertilize this. But we've got to wait for another growing stage before we can um, we can fertilize both fields, which we will probably get on get on and do tomorrow. So I think that's going to be it for today, peeps. Uh, I think we've done quite well. We've got two fields uh, sort of plowed. Cultivated, seeded, um, yeah, I'm quite quite pleased with our progress, and uh, I hope you guys have uh, enjoyed it today. And um, 
And yeah, we'll, we'll see. I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, so again, it'll probably be up between one, one and a half, one tomorrow UK time, one p.m. UK time. And um, I look forward to seeing you all then. So uh, yeah, so thank you everybody. Uh, again, you got the Discord. Um, yeah, so click onto the Discord, have a look at that, and um, and yeah, we'll uh, I'll be in touch. So yeah, thank you, thanks everybody, really appreciate it, and I'll see you all very soon. Ciao for now. <laughs>